I think the attitude is part of the cosplay. I love it. Love it. Christopher Height. Oh, yeah. That's, that's fair. I always assume this. Yep. The whole get up. How about, can we do a full turn here? Turn. The facial love expression. The facial it. expression is strong. On point. Any, any, any espionage flavored poses. That's incredible. Christopher, how you doing? I'm doing pretty good. You guys have probably seen me already today. I've been here all week. <laughs> love it. Love the dedication. Uh, so when you're when you're going to put, you know, a lot of times we see cosplays that you like a full armor get up. What makes you kind of go a, a little more of a non-traditional route? I've always been a really big fan of the deep lore, and so these guys are amazing. I love their costumes. But it's not something that truly digs into what Halo is for me. The armor is the armor, but the meat inside, the man under it, that's where the real core of the series is for me. And for me, specifically, Oni is sort of the dark side of all of Halo. They are yes, the boogeymen in the, si in the silence. Midnight Facility, Benjamin Gerard from uh, Hunt the Truth, the G Haverson from First Strike, all of those guys. They're not Spartans, but they're just as dangerous and maybe even a little bit more dangerous because you never see them coming. Facts. Welcome to the three o'clock lore panel that we didn't plan, but definitely needed. From your heart. Any questions from the judges, honestly? How much did Joseph pay you? <laughs> <laughs> did, did Joseph pay you and how much? No, I'm actually operating unsanctioned from the office. They yeah. don't even know I'm here. <laughs> the commitment. That's right. Love it. Excellent, Thank excellent. You, How about a round of applause for Christopher? I know where you live. 